Well, this might be one of the most insane glitches in a game. Uh, we are going to be able to duplicate any item that we can attach to uh, an arrow in The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. I don't usually do glitches and things like that. I usually just kind of do more of the normal stuff, normal kind of walkthroughs. But I thought, you know what? It's in the game for now. Might as well let you guys know about it before it gets patched. It's probably going to get patched because it's pretty OP. You got to get really good timing with this one. So I'm going to try to walk you through this as best as I can. We see these silver Lionel Saber horns. I started with five and now I have 17. Um, it is a little bit of uh, getting used to. I, I, you're going to have to understand and try to trial and error it. I would suggest placing down a save prior to. I just did that before starting this recording. Uh, but you're also going to want uh, a weapon equipped like a sword. Uh, you're going to want a shield equipped uh, just to be sure. Uh, you're not going to be doing anything with them, but you just want them equipped. And then what we're going to be doing is using multiple bows, okay? So you need at least three bows. So make sure you have three bows on you. doesn't matter what they are, uh, just three bows. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to attach a material. So you see I have 17 silver Lionel Saber Horns, right? I'm going to attach it. I'm going to push B to put the bow down. I'm going to pause it. I'm going to drop the first bow. I'm going to equip the second bow. Now this part, you got to unpause the game and pause it back really fast so kind of like this and if you do that correctly you're going to see that this bow now has the item on the arrow i'm going to drop this one as well i'm going to pick up the third bow right here and then i'm going to go uh, exit out i'm going to pick up both of my bows now i should have 18 now right so look again i have 18 i'm gonna i'm gonna equip it push b to put the bow down pause the game uh, drop the first one again look at look at the right side there look at the right side uh, on the arrow right you have the Lionel horn on the arrow I'm dropping this I have no bow equipped I'm equipping the second one there's no Lionel horn on this arrow unpause and pause really quick I didn't do it fast enough let me try it again Just trying to commentate this at the same time is very difficult okay so one more time I'm gonna drop that it has the item on the bow I'm gonna drop that nothing on the bow look at items on the bow on the second on the second bow right so i'm going to drop the second one and then i'm going to equip the third one and go like that now you might be wondering well why, why can't i just do that with like uh three at a time look i got 18 i'm gonna i'm gonna bring it all the way up to 20 okay watch i'll do it really quick okay boom oops wrong bow right boom i had 18 now i should have no oh, hold on i still have 18. did i do it wrong hold on give me a second like this it's like that like that boom boom should have 19 no okay hold on so sometimes it's finicky and it doesn't work. Uh, other times it works perfectly. So I don't, I can't figure out why that is. Um, messed that one up. I can't figure out why it's so inconsistent. Uh, I was getting it pretty consistently before recording. Uh, so I'm wondering if it's just like the recording thing here. That's kind of throwing me off of my, uh, the rhythm that I had. Uh, I also recommend picking up the bows as fast as you can. Why is it still at 18? Hold on here. Something's going on. Let me just do this in silence and see. There you go, 19. See, now, now that I'm focused up, it's like, I, I just have to, I can't commentate at the same time. It's just like, I, I gotta get the rhythm right. And uh, I, ha I have kind of like the rhythm. That's what I'm saying. Once you get the rhythm in your head, how, how fast to do it, it's like, it's weird. I don't know why it works sometimes the way it does. All right, guys, so I did a little bit more testing. I think I figured out the uh, the reason that it was a little bit inconsistent. So you know how when I was re-equipping the second bow, so like, look, for example, I have the first bow and then I'm pulling the item out, right? I'm at 29 now, by the way, right? I'm putting it down. I'm, I'm removing it, or I'm sorry, I'm dropping it, not remo removing it. I'm equipping a new one. And then at this point, I'm pausing, I'm pausing and pausing rather. And then you see how there's the item on the bow, on the arrow, right? And then I'm going to drop this one. I'm going to equip this one. I'm going to pick up the other two bows and I should yeah have 30 there you go see you have to you have to you have to hit a certain windows unpause and pause there's 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 two windows okay there's two windows there's a window so for example like look watch I'm, I'm equipping I'm I'm going that I'm dropping and now it's this part right here this is the window right here where you unpause and pause to make it duplicate on the second bow there's two windows the first window is is a wider window let's say that will still show the item showing up on the bow, but it's not going to correctly duplicate it. The second window is a little tighter, meaning you have to be a little bit quicker, and it too will still show as if the item did duplicate on your bow, but that one will actually allow it to duplicate where when you pick up the bows, it'll actually duplicate. Do you understand what I mean? So for example, um, I can be super quick with both of them where, again, you're seeing the item on the bow, but if I wasn't quick enough, then when I pick up the bows, 
it's not it's not gonna duplicate. So see that one duplicated. I'm like 31, right? Um, I'm equipping this one, right? I went I went pretty quick on that one. I should get it. I should technically get it, but I didn't. Why? Because I wasn't quick enough. And you still seen the item was on the arrow, like as if it duplicated, but I wasn't quick enough. So you really got to get that window like super tight. There you go. Maybe I might have been a little bit too slow in that one. Yeah, see, I was a little bit too slow. I could tell. Even though you're seeing it duplicate on screen, watch again. You're gonna see it duplicate, right? There you go. You seen it duplicate? That that whoops. That one should have. Yeah, see, that one worked because I was slightly quicker. I know I just wasted an arrow. I know it didn't seem like there was a difference in how fast I unpaused and paused, but I'm telling you, just from like. You can kind of feel it in your hand, right? When you're doing it yourself, you can feel it. And I'm telling you that there is one scenario where I am slightly faster. And that's the one where it usually correctly duplicates. And then there's one where I'm slightly slower, but I'm, I'm fast enough where, again, it's showing on screen. Like you can see on Link's arrow here that the item is on the second bow, but it's not registering the duplication correctly. Does that make sense? That's what I mean by there's two windows that's the only thing i can see that i'm doing different i've tried a bunch of things let me let me explain this okay i got you can see i have three different bows i've been using 38 45 and 44. part of me thought well hey maybe maybe the the, the third bow has to be the lowest level that that had nothing to do with it so i thought maybe the third bow has to be like the highest level that had nothing to do with it I tried even those kind of variations. I thought, okay, well maybe, uh, you know, maybe it was like this. Maybe it's like this when, you, when you're when you're putting it on, right? I'm like, maybe I got to pause it right here before the bow completely goes down. That wasn't it either, right? Watch, I mean, it doesn't really matter. That like that that was paused really quickly. I'm gonna equip this. I'm gonna pause and unpause, right? I'm gonna go like that, and I'm gonna pick up the bows, and it duplicated, right? I'm at 33, but now I'm gonna let the bow sit for a few seconds. I'm just sitting here, and now I'm gonna pause it. And now I'm going to drop it and now I'm going to equip it, right? And look, the duplication is there. I don't know if it's going to work. I don't know if I did it quick enough, but we'll see. I was at 33. Now I'm still at 33. Let me try it again, right? I'm going to sit there for a second. la di da di da Okay, hopefully I can get this window right so you can see what I mean. There you go. That was pretty quick. That should work. We were at 33. Now we're at 34. Do you see what I mean? So that doesn't doesn't matter either. I've, I've tested that out. The only variation that I can tell is how fast you unpause and pause the game even if it shows up on the second bow there's two windows like i said there's a window where the image will show on the bow okay but there's a slightly faster variation where it will actually literally duplicate the item in your inventory if you do it slightly faster than that yet it's weird man it's really weird you can do anything anything that you can stick to that okay um i'll show you i'll show you a good one i'll show you a good one this one i've been doing uh i know it's really random you're not going to understand why it's it's for a different thing i made a video on it how to defeat gleox easily but the springboard i got 12. i started out with five by the way <laughs> i got 12. i'm gonna do the same thing with that okay 12. watch this one drop okay equip right there it is right pick up the bows okay whoops i keep pausing it 13. So the point is you can duplicate anything apples fruits right all these fruits bombs that's gonna be useful uh puff, puff shrooms uh look, look at this even truffles man you can you can do a bunch of like all, all these, these things that are food iron shrooms you cook that that's extra defense uh razor shrooms i believe is extra attack if i cr remember correctly uh like there's all of these different things that you just duplicate and you you basically can do like look all these things rubies that you can sell Rubies that you can sell, like, look, rubies. Okay, this one's gonna be, this one's gonna be unfortunate if I mess it up because I'm gonna end up losing the ruby, but we'll try it. Ah, shoot. Ah, shoot. Ah, I messed it up. The crazy thing is you can even do it with Zonite, which you can then cash Zonite for crystallized uh, Zonite, you know, material. And then you can use that to upgrade your battery cell. I mean, I don't think that's worth it. It's probably faster to just go mine for it at this point. Uh, but obviously certain things that are not faster to do. I mean, apples, again, not worth it. Some of the more rare items, probably worth it i mean dude you can even do it with moo moo milk oh well, i guess it's not called moo moo milk in here fresh milk like the the possibilities are endless again like i got diamonds which are worth a fortune again for some reason when i noticed that if you only have one in your inventory and you and you mess it up it's going to remove it from your inventory if you don't get it right 
Uh, which is really weird. I don't, I don't, oh crap. I just literally did, I just did, oh gosh. See what I mean? So I have noticed that it is very inconsistent, especially per, per item. So you guys seen, I was doing it pretty consistently with the Lionel Horns. I'm trying to do it with a Hardy Truffle right now. I started at like two, I'm at six. Um, and it's like, it's just really all over the place in terms of consistency for some reason. There you go. That one worked. So that's like a seven. Um, you know, with the crystals, I'm still trying to get it right. I don't think this one's going to work right here. No, yeah, see, I, I did it. I did it wrong. Um, but I don't know. It's weird. So I don't know. Like, again, it's really inconsistent. It works sometimes. I mean, it's worth trying to do for now. I mean, it's better than nothing, right? So um, I don't know. It, it is what it is. But hopefully this helps you guys out. Uh, you know, I know it's a little glitch, but come on. We've been using glitches in Zelda games since the beginning. People use glitches for speed runs. If you ever watched an Ocarina of Time speed run, people have been using them forever. So if you don't want to use it, obviously don't use it. You know, it's not like you're uh, breaking the Well, you're kind of breaking the game in a way, but you know what I mean? I'm going to try this one more time. Hold on here. The diamond one more time. I'm going to drop a save. We're going to end it with me trying my best to get the, the diamond right. Because again, it seems like every item has like a different window or something I, I don't know it's really weird man it's just the way they work oh did we do it did we do it nah we didn't do it come on bro well for some reason i can't get the stones to duplicate correctly but maybe you guys will have better luck either way you've seen that you can do it with some pretty crazy uh items like i mean for real dude now i have what uh what was it? 35 silver lionel saber horns which have a 55 fuse attack power and i started off with literally five uh because that's the one i kept using as my testing uh it's kind of weird because it feels like almost like anything that has a one on it isn't working correctly if you only have one of it you know what let me you, i i'm telling you that's what it is let me try with a different stone and see uh if that would be the case i don't know it might it might just be like that i suck at using the stones but let me use like opal or whatever we're at 14. all right i was able to duplicate the, the opal or whatever so maybe that's what it is maybe i don't know let's see did i do it again it's at 15 and this one's tricky i don't know why that one's tricky but let's see did it work it worked. Okay, that one worked. What about uh, Topaz? Can I do Topaz? Okay, that one duplicated. So maybe, maybe you can't do it if there's only one in your inventory. Maybe you need two or more. Because, again, I did actually try it earlier with one of the uh, ancient arrows uh, and whatnot. And that I couldn't get right either. And I kept losing it because there was only one. Ironically, anything that had one that I tried, I couldn't seem to duplicate it. I don't know if it was just bad luck or what, but take that as you will. Anyways, we'll wrap this one up here. You guys do your own testing. You let us all know in the comment section below what you're able to uh, pull off, what you are successfully able to duplicate if you find any more consistent method. I try to do a lot of testing and show you guys a lot of different kind of things in this video. That's why it's probably a little bit more lengthy than it should have been. Uh, but, you know, hopefully uh, it helps you uh if you if you find use in glitches again glitches are not for everybody i get it and that's not typically what we do on the channel uh but i thought it was an interesting one and i wanted to share it with you guys so if you enjoyed the video leave it a like subscribe for more i got a ton of tears of the kingdom guides up on the channel uh live streams we've been doing it all and everything else nintendo see you soon until the next one game on and thanks for watching